attempt to uh, take some milk jugs, melt it down into a um, uh, more usable form of plastic, and then uh, attempt to take a piece of uh, PVC that I've cut off from a piece of scrap here and uh, use it for a form to uh, reform my, my plastic. This is how we're going to melt our plastic. I've got a like a tuna fish can that I've been uh, melting plastic in and uh, I'm using uh, milk jugs and I chop the plastic up into little pieces like this and then we'll uh, put the plastic in the oven and set it to between 350 and 400 degrees Fahrenheit on bake for about 20 minutes and uh, then I'll come back and uh, I'll pull that out of that can and put it in the mold let it dry. Now that I melted my plastic, uh, I put it in this form here and then put a plug in here to mash it inward to uh, make it flat and get the air bubbles out. So after about a little over an hour, um, I take the plastic out of the, the mold and this is what I come up with. Pretty nice. I'm impressed. Doggone bug run into me. <laughs> um, so anyways, let me do a take two. After an hour, um, I've taken the uh, plastic out of the mold and I put some more in the mold and it's uh, setting now. This is what I come up with. Pretty nice. So I'll be making some stuff with this in a different project. But I'm going to make three of these. Okay, well, after my second attempt to making uh, another form of plastic, it turns out that my form melted. And this is what I come up with. It still formed it pretty good, but there's some deformities about it. It's going to take a lot of work to straighten that back up. And now my form is ruined. So I'm going to have to rethink what kind of form am I going to make so it won't melt. <laughs> Well, although that we seem to have a little setback with the molding project, I'm going to rethink this out and uh, make a new mold and uh, see see what we can come up with. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel and uh, check out my next video. Uh -huh.